seems like it's a day, a nice day, day of perfect light. I'd like to know how to keep the autofocus on. Remember, I'm learning here. Need someone to look over some paperwork. I'm learning here. This video. Good morning. Good morning. 18 seconds use of your time. Would you prefer I come on here and just start right crack to it? Not let you warm up. Good morning. I'm blind as a bat. I can see again. This dice and this dice. One is the backgammon double dice. The opposite of this dice will create okay the total value of seven. So whatever number I show you, the opposite will be total of seven. So we need five minus seven is two. We need four minus seven is three. We need five minus seven is two. We need four minus seven is three. And one minus seven is six. But in this dice, okay, it's always going to be double or half. If I show you 16, the other side will say 32, or will it say 8? So we take it and we flip it. It's 8. I flip to the next side, it says 2. There is no half of 2. 2 cannot be cut in half. Isn't that funny? 2 cannot be cut in half because you cannot multiply. You cannot multiply. Or can you multiply 2 times the half of 2 is 1, which will make it 2, but there is no 1. We do not start at 1, 2, 4. We start at 2, 4, 8. Why? Is it because it's double for everybody? I don't know. Why don't we start at 1, 2, 4? We start at 2, 4, 8. It's almost like these single squares that I that I show over. Wow, well, where is those single squares from last night? Wasted. Here it is. Here it is. The single squares. Here's a single square. Here's a double square. So maybe this is what the difference is. Different houses. I can't explain this right now because whatever I'm going to explain won't mean anything to you other than the design itself. So 4 is opposite of 2. Pretty simple. We can go by Fibonacci. If, uh, binary, sorry, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. The opposite of 8, okay, is 16. 1 and 6 is 7. So 8 is now opposite 7. So if I was going in one door, I'd come out the other door, 8 and 7. If I show you 64, I'm showing you 64 this way. If I wanted to go 6 plus 4, it's 10. If I wanted to go 6 times 4, I, this is plus this is times, because the only way to make it is the X this way in the box. Is it? Unless we cut this box up, but like I showed you on the paper, we're not cutting this box up. Although this box is 9, maybe it's not 9. This is the face of 9. Can they both be facing 9? See the way there's one more level inside this cube? But now this is all discussable, because for me, for a layman person like me, this is the multiple, and this is the plus because I get to drag my lines from here, this corner, to this corner, this corner, to this corner. In the middle, I have to say, well, I think the middle is about here, layman terms of talking. So this is 1, and this is 5. So 1 Mars, 1 5 Mars. 6 times 4 is 24 is 6. 3 times 2 is 6. 6 and 6, we now have the split between 1 and 5 and the 2, 3, 4 vibration. This is what the dice cube told me. We do not have 1 in here, and we do not have 5, right? You notice 2, 3, 4, 6, the only numbers missing, 1 and 5, 6 and 4, 1, 3 and 2, 5. Does it do that for all of them? In here, we have 1 and 6 and 8. We have 1, 6 and 8 inside here. Um, 8 will down, be downgraded, okay? If all zeros equal 6, we're missing a digit because there's two digits here. We have to add a digit here. The digit we add is 6. I always add 6 to nothing because 5 is nothing in itself. If I'm going straight through a hole and the hole is a little curved, I have to curve with the energy. Energy must curve for proper passage. Energy can be moved. If one was energy, one can be shifted. Now to think of it, 
that when you play the game of blackjack, the ace is now the 11th card. Inside the house of 10, there are four 10s inside the house of 10 because we have 10, jack, queen, king, and in blackjack, they're all valued at 10. So you have four 10s equaling to 40, and then you have one 11. You have one ace. You can use it as one or 11, six, six, and who's passing through the gateway? Six. If you're passing between the two pillars, you are six at the pillar, carrying the movement of one. Can we say it that way? I don't know. Do you carry the pillars and come in as an elastic band? Coming in as an elastic band, holding on to the two pillars like a slingshot. Are we slingshot into here, or are we always connected to the elastic band? And once we die, it <laughs> comes out of our body, and we're, <clears throat> and we're dead. Why every time? You see the big dog in the center? His nose, his eye. Or you can look at it the other way as the alien head. The illusion of every design. The twist of the eight. The twist of the eight. The twist of the eight. The toilets in Europe and the toilets because this has been twisted. This earth. So we showed you this dice. We showed you that four is opposite of two. Let's say eight and let's say one. But since we still don't have a double, we need at least two digits here to reduce it. We need six twice. Six and six is 12, plus two is 14. One and four becomes five. Here we only need it once. So it becomes first one and eight, which is the heaven. Then it becomes one and five through Mars. And now we switch them both. This one becomes one. And this one becomes five. We add another six to this, this becomes seven, this becomes eight. Now Mars becomes the gateway. Now wait one second here. Would this have been a better video if I wrote it down? We have the eight, which we become five and seven, and now we have the passing of the moon. Now since we could increase this one one, we're also going to increase this one, one, and that will give us four. So it'll be five and seven, five and four. It'll now say moon, sun, seven, eight, passage gate. The spirit of the half-life, two, three, four, and five. Between two and five is three and four. We pass through the DC world with the one spirit of the six man. Ninety-one is the number to the spirit. Seven times thirteen, one and three is four, seven and four. Seven times four, twenty-eight, the cycle. Plus 11, 7, and 4 equals 39, the cycle of Saturn, Saturn moons. And this is basically the way this dice talks to me, and the way this dice talks to me is a little bit different. If I had to add 6 onto 6, I would end up with 3 and 7. 7 and 3 would be Nibiru. So right away, Nibiru would be the half-life. If I go to 2, which would be 8 and 5, which would be Earth, would now be 8 and 2, which would be the cycle of Earth. If I take 3 and 4, I now go 9, which is the birth, 9 and 1, the spirit, all zeros equal 7, 9 and 7, the gateway to birth. And this is the way 6 talks to me. 5 is not the same. 4 is not the same. None of them are the same. And the other side of everything is either 2 or 6. That is the below. The high side would be your birth and the delta angle, or 64, the barnyard doors, the creation of the Christ by a kitchen knife on the scientific table, the elements, creation of life, the AD4, the AD5, the BC6, the BC5. Multiplication of two times three and one times four and plus one four and plus two three nine eleven birth factor coming in. I said what I did and it is what it is. Thank you for watching. Take it as you could. Just understand together. Be nice to your fellow people around you as best you can and stand up for your rights without getting in into any trouble. And sometimes it's better off to be quiet for now. We just have to build up uh, and pass 
a little bit of time before everything turns over. Praise God. Gates of Omega.